Alright, so today I'm going to go over the steps on how to roll some film. Uh, right now inside this bulk loader we have a 100 foot roll of film and we want to get it inside one of these canisters. Okay, but first let's take a look. There are three different kinds of canisters. There are two that are metal and they have uh, this type of spool inside where it has this opening in it that you can see through and they have caps on on both ends. Then there's the plastic which just has the cap on one end and they have the solid spools and it is important to use the correct spool with the correct caster so that it loads inside properly. Okay, But after that the steps are exactly the same. So I'm going to use the plastic caster and the other materials that we need are a pair of scissors and a roll of tape. I'm just going to take some tape, about two to three inches of tape. I'm going to secure this spool to the end of the film here, that this little flap that's that's been exposed to light already. I'm going to put the tape on and I'm going to wrap it around the back all the way to the other side until it touches onto the film. And then I'm going to give it a little pinch and roll so that it's on there secured all the way around. Pick up my caster. It is important to make sure that we are putting this on the right direction. There is a flat piece of plastic here and then it curves away from me. Okay, And then this it just meets right back up with the opening. So you want to make sure that flat piece of plastic is facing the sky and we're going to slide that on. Okay. Also on this spool we want to make sure that this knob and this knob are facing each other. Put that on and then take the cap. Okay, It's got a little point. We're going to put the point facing up and then we're going to turn the point till it locks into place with the canister. Secure the canister inside the bulk loader. Close up the front flap. Right now the gate is in the upright and locked position which means the film in here is protected from light. But now we need to open the gate so we can allow the film to flow forward and into the canister. Make sure this is all nicely locked together. And you're going to roll away from you and count to 15 to 20, uh, even up to 30, depending on the size of the roll of film you want to make. Okay. Once that's done, you're going to bring the gate back up to the lock position so that when we open the front flap, the film in there is still safe. And we're going to release the canister by pulling apart both sides of the bulk loader and pulling some film forward. Notice that I pulled the film from inside here so that um, I didn't waste the film. I just spent the time rolling into the canister. I'm going to cut this off somewhere along the middle. And the last step is to cut the lead which is down the middle of your film and then swing your scissors to the right creating this J shaped notch in your film allowing us to catch the film inside the camera. You can see another video on how to load the film into the camera. All right, And that is how to roll some film.